Hi guys and welcome to 123MyIT's video on how to invert colours on your Mac. Ok guys, so um, some Macs you're able to uh, invert the colours by holding down the Control, Alt, Option and Command keys and then pressing 8. Um, so they would be these three keys along the bottom here. And then you would press number 8 um, on your keyboard. Um, now if this doesn't work on your Mac, what you can do is you can go into the System Preferences icon Alright, and then go into Accessibility Alright, and in the left hand side here if you see the Display icon and then you can literally just click on the tick there where it says Invert Colours Okay, and this is uh, sometimes used for some uh, people who have uh, trouble seeing certain colours um, or visually impaired uh, people can use this as well um, or if you just like to change the colours around on your Mac you can also use it there's also another tick below it which says use grayscale which change it to just black and white on your Mac now you can enhance your contrast to make it go really dark or you can have it as um, slide these sliders back and forth. You can make your um, your cursor really big, so you want to see your mouse cursor. You can see where it is there now. We've set it to large, and then it's just back to normal. All right. You can take off this invert colors as well, and just use grayscale. So this will give you all your normal um, color depth back, but it will just be in black and white. All right, guys. So that's how you do it. Um, so let's. Uh, Let's just uh, try and start up a web browser and give you an idea of what the colours would look like. Um, using it this way, it also um, uh, also uses less power as well. Um, so your your laptop will um, use less energy when you when you use it this way as well. Alright, uh, so there you can see that's just brought up the web page and that's the Safari page there, you can see the colours of that one it's changed quite, um, quite differently. Alright guys, so if that was helpful please leave a thumbs up um, don't forget to hit the subscribe button in the bottom right hand corner of the screen and uh, if you have any questions please feel free to leave some feedback on the website. Thanks guys, bye bye.